During an emergency landing, you must assume a brace position. Tuck your feet firmly on the floor behind your knees. Place your head against the seat in front of you. Tuck your hands behind your knees or below the tights. Remember to keep the brace position until the aircraft comes to a stop. Are you ready to test your knowledge? Ok, now it's your turn! Begin with placing the feet. Good! Now place the head. Right! Now place the hands. Fine! Finished! You should assume the brace position more quickly. You should practice more. During a water evacuation, you must be able to wear a life vest. Now, I will show you how to wear a double chamber life vest located under the seat. But always pay attention to specific instructions concerning life vests available on your flight. Learn how to wear a life vest so you will be able to wear it quickly. Extract the pouch from the compartment under the seat. Open the pouch by pulling the tab. This is the hole for the head, and these straps will go around your waist. This type of life vest can be worn on both sides. Slip the life vest over your head. Wrap the strap around your waist. Buckle up the strap. Firmly pull the tab on the end of the strap until it is snug around your waist. Inflate the life vest by pulling the red handles, but do it only when leaving the aircraft. Are you ready to test your knowledge? Ok, do your best! First, extract the pouch. Ok! Now open the pouch. Right! Now put on the life vest. Good! Now wear the strap. Done! Now buckle the strap. OK. Finally, adjust the strap. Good. Finished. You should wear the life vest more quickly. Many users have been faster in completing this trial. You should practice more. In the event of loss of cabin pressure, oxygen masks will drop down automatically and you should wear them as fast as possible. Reach up for a mask and pull it down to activate it. Place the mask over your nose and mouth and slip the elastic strap over your head. Pull the ends of the strap to adjust the mask. When you're wearing the oxygen mask, breathe normally. Be sure to wear 
and secure your own mask before helping others. Are you ready to practice? Ok, let's start! First, take the mask. The mask should not be taken in this way. Let me show you how to do it. Reach up for the mask and pull it down to activate it. Try again. I know you can do better. You are giving me a headache. You are giving me a headache. Ok. Now wear the mask. Good! Finally, adjust the mask. The mask is not adjusted. Done! Finished! You have made some mistakes in the trial. Many users make mistakes at first, but with a little practice they manage to complete the trial without errors. You should practice more. During an emergency evacuation, you must be able to locate the exits closest to you. Before going to the exits, you must leave all your luggage behind. There are six exits on this aircraft, three on each side. Four exits have a floor-level door. Two exits are window exits over the wings. All exits are clearly marked by an exit sign. Remember that the closest exits can be behind you. Are you ready to test your knowledge? Ok, do your best. Look around and tell me where is the closest exit. Done! Where would you go in case of evacuation? No, the correct direction is this one. Examine the cabin more carefully. The closest exit is on that side. OK. Where is the closest exit? Good! Finished! You have made some mistakes in the trial. I suggest you to try again.
this aircraft has two different types of exits. Let's see the first. This is a floor level door. In some emergency situations, you might have to open it. Learn the procedure to open this door, so you will be able to do it quickly. First, check the external conditions by looking through the observation window. Be sure there is no fire or other danger outside. If there is no danger, rotate the handle. Firmly push the door to open it. After opening the door, the slide will automatically inflate. Are you ready to test your knowledge? Okay, let's start! First, check for danger. Don't forget to check for danger before opening a door. Never mind, I'll show you. Look through the observation window to check for danger. Try again. Right. Now operate the handle. Done. Now open the door. Right. Finished. You have made some mistakes in the trial. Many users make mistakes at first, but with a little practice they manage to complete the trial without errors. I suggest you to try again. Now let's see the second type of exit. This is an overwing window exit, and if you are seated near it, you must be able to open it in case of evacuation. First, check the external conditions by looking through the exit window. Be sure there's no fire or other danger outside. If there's no danger, remove the cover that protects the handle. Pull down the handle and the exit will automatically open. When it is open, you can exit on to the wing. Would you like to see the procedure again, know more about it, or try it together? Ok, now it's your turn! Done! Now, remove the cover. Fine! Right! Finished! Perfect! Trial successfully completed. 